I think being racialized at UFT is being tolerated but not accepted, being judged and not understood, being stereotyped and generalized about all the time and not being given a chance to possess any sort of individualism. For me, it means being brown before being anything else. Many times feeling visible, but um, vis I guess physically present, but epistemologically missing because everyone knows nothing about you and you know everything about every other person. Having to enter a space and consciously be aware of the fact that I'm the only black person there. Coming from a background that I think not a lot of, not the majority of students come from, uh, provides you an opportunity to engage um, with the U of T community in a very special way. And I think the challenge is, uh, I face is sort of feeling a sense of alienation, um, partly because you come from communities that may be mostly African Canadian, and then that's what you're used to, and you come to U of T and you don't see much of uh, people that kind of share your background or look like you, so trying to get over that sense of alienation is a challenge. Sometimes I do feel lonely and as if I have to take up the battle by myself. There is a significant portion of racialized students at my own campus, U of T Scarborough, and yet the faculty and staff don't seem to reflect the student body's diversity. I need to justify my decision to make it sound like more legit or like reasonable. And sometimes I'm, I may feel confused when my ideas was shut down. Uh, I may think, is that me or is that uh, because I'm racialized? Is that just uh, my idea is not good enough? Or am I just too sensitive? People judging me based off of uh, you know, my background, so they assume certain things about my character and my beliefs because, for example, like a, an Afghan Canadian you know, or an Afghan Muslim must be someone who um, who has like certain reservations about how women ought to act or uh, you know the way that they should be treated which um, you know it's really baseless and until you get to know an individual it's um, pointless to really make any assumptions about them. I have to answer questions about whether or not this is my hair or why I don't look like everybody else. I think there are these small um cultural barriers that I encounter very frequently being racialized at UFT because you're constantly trying to filter out perceived brown qualities regardless of whether they are a part of you or not. And it's not because you're embarrassed or ashamed of your heritage, it's just to escape those harrowing derogatory questions. Like I remember somebody asked me, if you're from India, how do you know how to speak English? And if you're from India, don't you all speak Hindu? But Hindu's a religion, nobody speaks a religion. So people want to know, where are you from? Why do you speak such good English? Why do you have such good experiences? Oh my God, you're so intelligent. The knowledge and the experiences that are foregrounded in classes many times doesn't speak to me. It doesn't speak to my current academic interest. It doesn't speak to my future career interest. So it's always a struggle having to create your own space, finding your own allies, um, to be able to build a community, an intellectual and social community that enables you to do what you think you came to U of T to do. I find community everywhere at UFT and yet nowhere which puts me in a dichotomous situation because there are people of my race and ethnicity all over the campus but whenever I interact with them I do notice a sense of embarrassment towards their heritage and this negligence towards their identity indicators and I feel this constant desire to want to amalgamate with the mainstream and the fear of not being identified as a fresh off the boat or whatever that means. At the University of Toronto, I find community among friends. It's, it's always uh, comforting and it, it's fun to be able to sort of, you know, not have to always hide a different part of myself. Uh, so, so it's just, um, it serves as, as like a release and as, as a place where I can be among friends and people who I can relate to and understand on a different level. I find community with all kinds of people in the university, whether they be from the same cultural background as my own or not. 
Um, to me, community means coexisting and living at peace with people who are like you or not. Um, specifically, I find this sense of community with people working in equity and social justice related circles because I find that they truly share my values of mutual acceptance and tolerance. I find community at UFT through my graduate program. We are, are a cohort of 80 students and a lot of the students don't come from UFT so this is their first time engaging with the UFT community and because of the rigorous nature of my graduate program uh, we often find ourselves working on assignments together and supporting each other throughout the program. Uh, my, my identity and experiences have helped me sort of claim my space here at the university through um, you know, the community that I formed with my friends and also through my involvement with the Afghan Students Association to, to sort of you know, create a space for other people where they can feel welcome and where they can feel understood and, and, and safe and just enjoy themselves and have a community of their own. I have no trouble to express myself and I've learned how to do that in a certain way, not to directly offend people, but let more people be aware of their powers and my own powers. I have been able to use the experiences um, that I guess I've accumulated over the years because of all of these things I identify with um, to assert a, a particular type of currency um, within my school and for example Massey College as well to be able to start initiatives that specifically speaks or tries to question the absence of certain knowledge and certain people within the spaces that we occupy and to see what we can all do to make Canada a truly truly inclusive place for all of us. My identity as an Asian person, combined with my own personality, have really allowed me to become empowered and claim space at the University of Toronto by breaking negative stereotypes around Asian people. Unfortunately, negative stereotypes exist, like that Asian people are voiceless, quiet, and submissive, but through my bold personality and my bold um, actions, I find that I break these stereotypes and create a positive impact, not just for myself, but other Asian people at U of T who suffer from these negative stereotypes. I am U of T because I find solace in being who I am. I am one of millions of black and racially profiled individuals who lives in a world where people say that my complexion is the only thing that truly defines who I am. I am U of T because I'm so involved and empowered to engage other underrepresented student groups. I am U of T because I'm not afraid to challenge traditional thoughts or practices um, in the name of integrity. I'm intellectually curious and I'm always striving to learn and helping others to do the same. I am U of T because um, I have been able to acquire critical knowledge about my own identity, about how I've come to relate with the world. I've also come to see that the life that I live um, is on the back of a whole bunch of people who have given up so much um, to ensure that people like me can walk around U of T feeling like I have a voice. I am U of T because I have a responsibility to let other racialized students know that they need to be here too. While at times they may feel foreign, this is as much a home to them as it is to anybody else on this campus. While being a racialized student at U of T does provide its own unique challenges, it also provides an opportunity for us to continue to establish our legacy as key to the fabric of this institution. I, of course I'm U of T because um, I stand for equality, respect and acceptance. I'm confident but not arrogant. I'm fiery but not aggressive. I'm passionate but not dreamy. I am U of T because I demand, want and have the right to be. I. 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 I am U of T. 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 We are U of T.